This is where the true presence of Jesus lived. Our good messages and readings are read here. This is the table of the Lord. All Christians that are to be welcomed into the church surround this structure. This image should remind us all of the sacrifice that Jesus made for all of us. The home of the original statue is in the capital of the Czech Republic and has provided spiritual uplift to those who have adopted its ways of humility, simplicity, and sincerity. You can find this statue in almost every Catholic church all over the world. But let's take a closer look, because what you're about to hear is something that I'll bet almost no one knows. The left hand encircles a miniature globe with a cross on top, signifying the worldwide kingship of the Christ child. The right hand is extended in blessing, with the first two fingers being upraised to symbolize the two natures of Christ, human and divine. While the folded thumb and last two fingers touch, representing the unity of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit in the mystery of the Blessed Trinity. What is the name of this statue? The uncomfortable rows of benching that keep us awake during Mass. This is the patron saint of our parish. These are used at baptism, confirmation, holy orders, and anointing of the sick. This man is a carpenter, the husband of Mary, and the foster father of Jesus. This is the mother of Jesus and the wife of Joseph. These tell the story of Jesus' last day, his crucifixion, death, and resurrection. This is a plate for bread and also the cover for the cup that holds the wine. This cup is used to hold the Eucharist. This light burn, burns continuously to indicate and honor the presence of Christ. This is the most sacred part of a church. This is blessed by a priest, a found inside a church, and is a reminder of three things for us, repentance of sins, protection from evil, and baptismal promises. This book contains a collection of scripture readings. A new one of these is blessed and lit every year at Easter, and it is also used for special occasions like funerals and baptisms. <laughs> 